It took me one week to flatten following these easy tips. Look at that length. Look at that thickness. It's real 4C hair. And you can get here too. This is a video that your haters never wanted you to see. I'm going to show you how to grow long, thick, healthy 4C hair. And I'm going to show you how I flatten my stomach with these easy, healthy tips. My last hair secret will change your life. The last secret is my biggest hair secret ever, and I've never shown anyone or told anyone about this. And to be quite honest, I just discovered it recently, and it has helped to grow my hair tremendously. Disclaimer. And yes, I am naturally curvy. I know you all know that I'm very passionate about hair care, but I'm also very passionate about body image and how a lot of women are made to feel inferior simply because they do not possess a body type that is praised by social media and current beauty standards. If anyone ever tries to make you feel inferior about your body type, that is because they are an insecure person and they want to try and bring you down in order to establish a sense of self-worth. Now let's go. Number one, rose oil, sweet almond oil, and peppermint oil hair mask for softening and hair growth. I wore my rose water on the stove and I used about one and a half cups of sweet almond oil, sometimes OGX coconut oil, and peppermint oil. I bag it and leave it on for a day, then the next day I go in with my everyday use hair growth oil. Next I go in with a shampoo and conditioner mixture in order to make sure that my hair is clean but not too stripped. This is really great if you don't want to get any dryness. I lost the rest of the footage from that day, but here's another clip of me rinsing out the shampoo and conditioner mix, and does anybody else love getting their hair done outside? There's just something so relaxing about getting your hair done outside. Number two, drink more water. I used to overeat all the time, which would cause my stomach to expand because I thought that I was hungry when in actuality, I was really just dehydrated. Number three, the greenhouse effect. This one is so important, so listen up and pay attention. So what I do is I coat all of my hair with my favorite moisturizing conditioner. I actually like to use a mixture of my favorite deep conditioner and my favorite regular conditioner. It really helps to give me a lot of slip. The next thing that I'm going to do is go in with the hair growth oil and I'm going to get that all over my scalp follicles. This is very important. Stay with me here. Stay with me. And I really focus to make sure that I get it all over my scalp and I don't miss a single spot because this is so important. Next, I'm just going to gather my hair all together and then I'm going to put it under a plastic shower cap. And yes, I was really having a lot of fun. <laughs> After I put my hair under the shower cap, this is going to trap the heat inside of the shower cap and create an extremely warm and moist environment, causing an increase in blood flow, which will stimulate the hair follicles and help to raise the growth rate. This theory is called the greenhouse effect and honey, it's been working for me. Number four, hair mayo. One of the most amazing products I've ever tried in my entire life. But here's the good thing about it. It has a mixture of shea butter and a bunch of other healthy ingredients for your hair. And it doesn't leave your hair smelling like actual mayo. It does include egg yolk and all the ingredients that you would want to put in a hair mayo mask, but without the terrible smell. And this is a product that I got from Ulta. It's so amazing. This is not sponsored. This is my genuine opinion. Nobody asked me to make this a video. So first I like to warm it up. And this smells nothing like mayo from the grocery store. So what this does is it helps to strengthen my hair so that when my hair is growing, I can retain all of the length that I grow so that my hair does not break off and keep getting shorter. Number five, keep my protective styles in for at least two weeks and I always make sure to use a hair growth oil while I have my protective styles in and I oil my ends as well. Number six, cholesterol treatments are so, so important. I would not have long hair if I didn't do cholesterol treatments. I'll put a link to the video that I made on cholesterol treatments in the description box. Number seven, I replace my cookie cravings with healthy popsicles. Number eight. All right, so now this is my best hair growth tip. I've never told anyone this hair secret. You all are the first ones to hear it. hair steaming, but I've combined it with the greenhouse effect and it's dramatically increased my hair growth rate. The greenhouse effect is already a very intense hair growth treatment, but when I combine it with my hair steamer, it just makes everything even better than it already was. As always, thank you all so much for watching and if you're not already, make sure you're following me on Instagram. Bye!